Have you ever stopped to think? The Earth is spinning at over 1,000 miles per hour at the equator. We don't feel a thing. Why? Part 1. Constant Motion Let's start with the basics. Motion is only felt when it changes. When you're in a car cruising at a steady speed, you barely notice it until the brakes hit or the car turns. The Earth spins at a constant speed, so there's no sudden acceleration to alert our senses. This smooth, unchanging motion is invisible to our inner balance system, the vestibular system. Part 2. Gravity's Grip But what about the spinning force? Shouldn't it throw us off the planet? Actually, gravity is far stronger. While centrifugal force from Earth's rotation does slightly reduce your weight, gravity pulls you firmly toward the center of the planet. At the equator, you weigh just a tiny bit less than at the poles, but the difference is too small to feel. Part 3. Why the air and oceans don't spin away You might wonder, if the Earth is spinning, why don't the oceans or atmosphere fly off? It's because everything, the air, the oceans, you, your chair, is moving with the Earth. We all share the same frame of reference. Unless a massive force acts against this system, nothing appears to move. Can we ever feel it? So is there ever a moment we can feel Earth's spin? Not directly, but indirectly, yes. The Foucault pendulum, for example, proves Earth's rotation using simple physics. And the Coriolis effect, which makes storms spin in different directions in each hemisphere, is also due to Earth's spin. So, we don't feel the Earth spinning not because it's not happening, but because it's so constant, so smooth and so immense, our bodies are built to live with it. It shapes our weather, our time, our very perception of day and night. Invisible, yes, but deeply powerful. Still curious about everyday science questions like this? Hit like, subscribe, and stick around. The world spins fast, but we'll slow it down for you.